So let's say I want to sum this series. 3 plus 3.7 plus 4.4 plus 5.1 plus 5.8 and so on up to the 70th term. And I want to add all of these numbers together. So I'm going to use one of these formulas. Now I'm only, I want to sum the series, so I want to use either that or that. Now what do I know? I know A, A is 3. I know D, because that's just 0 0.7, that's what I'm adding on each time. And I know N, because I want 70 terms. So it lends itself to using the last formula rather than that one because I don't know what the last term is. I could work out the last term if I wanted to using the nth term, but it just causes more work for me. That's why I have two formulas in the first place. So if I use that formula, then S70, the sum up to the 70th term, is 1 half times n times 2 lots of a, so 2 lots of 3, that's 6, plus n minus 1, well that's 69, times d, 0.7. Throw that into the calculator, so 0 0.5 times 70, times 6, plus 69 times 0 0.7, and I get 1900.5. So my suggestion to you is really identify what you have and identify which of these two formulas will get the job done the easiest. Plug the numbers in, substitute the numbers in, use your calculator.